Uh, is Pete Carroll right to say quarterbacks on his roster is better than the quarterbacks that were drafted? Um, let's go ahead and pop it off with those. Wait, whoa, whoa, run that back. <laughs> Pete Carroll, pretty much, who Pete Carroll got the right to say that his quarterbacks on his roster is better than the quarterbacks that were drafted this year. He said, he said the quote, I think um, Drew Luck would have been the first guy pit of, of of any quarterback in this draft this year. And then he also said that um, not him, but the whole Seahawks believe that Malik Willis is not NFL ready. Hold on. <laughs> Who they got right now? Drew Luck? Right. Geno Smith, the starter. Yeah, <laughs> You talk about that Drew Lock, huh? You talk about, you talk about that Drew Lock. That motherfucker yeah, the, suck. The, yeah, the he Drew Lock. I'm rapping on the sideline. He suck. He sucks. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep. We gotta keep it a buck, bro. He suck. Like if we if we being honest, right? Mm-hmm. Pete Carroll had one of the greatest, you know, short quarterbacks ever. You know what I'm saying? And then you go to Drew Lock. Matter of fact, let me let me switch that up. Let me switch that up because that's kind of fucked up. We went from Hall of Fame quarterback to Drew Locke. There you go. There's nothing else to say. I don't I don't really have much to say because this is the thing. How many times have we seen Drew Locke screw up in the NFL? Right. I wish I could count both fans, but a bit more than that. A couple of times, and this man ain't been in the league enough, right? Man, we've seen this man choke so many times in college as well. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't know about you, but I'm starting to feel like Pete Carroll getting a little bit too old. If I'm starting I mean, to think he's getting too old. He's having all timers. <laughs> yeah. Because cause I don't know about you, but I've seen the film. I've seen the games. Drew Locke is not that guy. I guarantee if if I guarantee if Marshawn Lynch is on that team, bro, Nah, you lock nah, bro. I don't want him. You know what I'm saying? You, you gotta be, bro, this is this was a terrible thing to say. This was a stupid thing to say, and I thought Pete Carroll was smart. I thought he was a smart individual. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. How many of the people really, you know, raise your hand if you believe in Drew Lock? <laughs> okay. So like I said, like I said, all right then. That's that's my take on on that on that stupid ass quote. That shit was stupid as fuck. Well, yeah, I, it, if it if it's true though, is it, like if Drew Lock like at the same you know level as like you know Kenny Pickett, oh, is Kenny Pickett better than Drew Lock or are they the same player? Feels like this because he doing, might have a point. Stop doing this to me, Frank. You know it, it, how- yeah, let, let, oh shit, my bad. I wasn't even trying to do that to you. Stop oh, I was just my bad. I hate. Look, let me tell you something. <laughs> um, you know how people really liked Baker Mayfield when he first got into the league. Yeah. Take Baker Mayfield right now, and put that on Drew Locke right now, and put that as forever. So that's that's pretty much what you have, bro. I don't like that. You know, uh, Pete Carroll can sit here and be like, "Yeah, I like who I have," and this and that and the third. Motherfucker ain't even play a game for you. Come on, bro. Let's be real. Get that man a quarterback, uh, you know, duel or some shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, he need to work for that, bro. Ain't no way in hell you already talking high noise. Uh, are you sure they talking about him? Because I hope he talking about another quarterback on the hey, list. I checked the death chart. I had to make sure I was thick and shaking that, you know. Boy, it Gino, Gino Smith. Because, I mean, Gino, Gino nice. You know what I'm saying? If we talking about, yeah, Gino back on the draft board. Of course, you'll pick Geno Smith back in his heyday when he fresh out of West Virginia. Yeah, nah, do the same thing. If we're being honest, they they both are first round draft picks, former just first round draft picks. Nah, Drew Lock got picked like in the fourth. I thought he was like he really. Let me see. He didn't no, get picked. In the first pick. He was like four or maybe second. I don't know. This was between the I second. I think sec- and it may have been second. Like he wasn't even a first round pick. What? And he's talking about you satisfied. Come on, son. I give him Kenny Pickett. I ain't gonna lie. Hell, Cap, if I was Seattle, if I was Seattle, I would have just signed Teddy Bridgewater. 
If you if you need quarterback just uh get around for the season, Teddy Bridgewater. I mean I, Teddy I, I Bridgewater, want. quarterback, quarterback. I'm so sorry, bro. Yeah, you can take a him. I'm gonna sign Teddy. That boy prone. <laughs> that he is prone. He is prone, but then again, let, let me ask y'all this question. Mm-hmm. Your team. So for example, Frank, Bucks, Darius, Niners, Zoe, Steelers. You ain't got no quarterback, right? But you need a quarterback to at least get through the season so you can draft a quarterback next year. Because the next year draft is gonna be loaded with quarterbacks. Next year draft is stacked for quarterbacks. So, but you gotta get through the season though. You gonna sign Teddy Bridgewater or you gonna trade for Drew Lock? Just be honest. If I if I'm the Bucks, I'm gonna just get Teddy Bridgewater. Even though he injured prone, we still got Kyle Trash back there. I'm just signing Teddy Bridgewater just because hey, I, hey. I mean like I believe in Teddy more than I believe in Drew. I'm gonna Listen. tell you I'm, I'm gonna yeah. tell you I'm gonna pick Drew. Go ahead. Cause he suck. Okay. I know we're not gonna win like that. I know you're not. So I'm gonna pick Drew Lock. It's easy. Hey. That's 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 no problem, bro. Hey, and though kind of I le- a little bit took my take on it. Like I feel like this is cover up to give the fans, you know, hope and shit. I feel like Pete Carroll thinking this year. He he's trying to think for a quarterback next year because he don't like the quarterbacks that you know he see in the draft this year. That's all I think it is. Like that's why I got from reading this. Like he's really thinking, what but you know. Fired, what if he get fired for this season? So what? What all that thinking? You know. You no, know, I think I think to get, a, to get a quarterback is all for nothing. No, I think he working with the owners and doing it on purpose. You know, owners are for some owners are for thinking. Look at Jacksonville, not Jacksonville, Miami, Miami. They want to tank. They, that whole tank is in there real going on over there. Yeah, because I thought he was saying he was thinking. I was like, nah, that's the wrong T word. But oh my bad. I know. I mean, think. I mean, you know. Yeah, tanking. Being trash. Yeah. Yeah, tanking. That's that's what he gonna do. You know, that's the that's the best you can do, motherfucker. Like you you gotta think about it, right? This man makes some of the dumbest. Dumbest dumb decisions, bro. Ever since you were supposed to run the ball, motherfucker, you've been making dumbass choices ever since. <laughs> the only smart choice you have ever made was to drive DK Matt Metcalf ever since. You know what I'm saying? Everybody else been gone. Hold on, let me look at this roster real quick. What is what Seattle's roster, roster looking like? Bro, do they have a That's the thing. Seattle roster is still talented. It's still not. not it, it is. In a way, Wait. it is. Do they have still a line? Got Andre Diz. <laughs> That's a good question. But do they have a line, though, bro? Oh, my boy wants to win. You know what? Now that you my said, boy wants to win one that for his life. Line, I forgot about that. <laughs> I ain't, never mind. We, I take my comment back. I take it back. Because you lost all types of leadership on both sides of the ball. You have to start completely over. This is not a good roster at all. It's, That's it's, technically what you're saying. Like, that's what they have to do, bro. Like, with these trades that they did was stupid as fuck, bro. Let's be honest. Like, yeah. letting go of Russell, uh, Russell Wilson. Why his name such a tongue twister, bro? Um, him and an old boy. Um, who did he just let go? Wagner? Is that his name? Wag, mm-hmm. yeah, Wag. Think about it. That shit was dumb. That shit was dumb. You, you feel what I'm saying? Like, that's like letting go of... Uh, I, don't, I don't know, bro. Like, how do you let go of something like that? You know what I'm saying? Leadership on both sides of the ball. Well, like the to be honest, the they wanted to go, though. Hmm? They wanted to go. Russell was trying to go since last year. They wanted to go. They, Russell they was trying to get out of there since last year. Wagner was not trying to get out of there. No. I mean, Wagner ain't Wagner trying to or, lose. Or, or, Wagner um, ain't trying to lose. I don't think, I don't think Russell was trying to get up out of there, like, for real, until um, the season's over and his name kept getting mentioned in trade talks. So it's kind of like, okay, cool. Y'all want me to get up out of there? Then, okay, cool. I want to go now. Oh, you better get peer pressure? Yeah, pretty much peer pressure. This man, Pete no Carroll pressure 70. on Wag. He got released out of nowhere. This man, Pete Carroll, is 70, bro. He's 70? 70. What the uh, hell? Bo, what? if Urban Myers had to sit down, he needed to sit his ass down, too. What would your reaction be if they did make the playoffs this year? Who? The Seahawks. What would your reaction be if they actually make it? Wait, wait, wait. They make it, they make it. With Drew Locke as their starter. It's the first round exit. But I, I, I'm 1,000% sure 
Seattle not making it, and they damn sure will be like the top three, top five pick, um, picking in next year's draft. Definitely. I feel like if they ever do make it, bro, that mean you telling me all the got the NFC teams might be doing trash. Gotta be sorry as fuck. <laughs> Every team must be doing trash if they make it, bro. I can't believe it. But yeah, that's what I was thinking originally, man. They were thinking, bro. That's that's what I just I read I read through all that. Bro. I know Darius happy. <laughs> yeah, he tired of Seattle, bro. He tired. Smack, he tired of fucking, smack the Seahawks up for the next few years, pretty much. Now y'all will be on the sweep this time. Y'all sweeping their ass. Oh, man. I don't know, bro. Like, I don't feel the same because I'm wrestling up, bro. Like, if we do beat them, I won't be that decided. It won't be the same type of feeling like what had been in wrestling. But I don't know, probably beat them on Drew Lock ass. <laughs> <laughs> I would hope that Bacon Mayfield got traded to them. That'd be like 10 times better. I'd be happy watching those games. <laughs> Who wouldn't? They didn't even check for Baker. I mean, Baker not good, but like shit. Like, yeah, he got Eugene Smith. Uh, better opportunity to win it than Drew Lock does. Yeah, but they got some hitters out there at uh, San Francisco. So imagine old boy coming off that corner. Oh, uh, well, we got some old defensive players too. You know what? Yeah, that that's what makes sense. Teddy Bridgewater would have survived in the NFC West with those defenses. We got more defensive Anyways. players. We got the whole new DN. <laughs> Bro, I really wanted y'all to get Thibodeau. Y'all would have been crushing. Oh uh, man, I love it. I'm telling y'all, bro. Imagine Thibodeau with with the with the Niners, bro. That would have been like some Patrick Willis shit, dog. And I would have so, loved it. Very sick. It'd been nice to get the line back. In. I feel like we had it. Man, he would have been a good choice for y'all. Yeah. Home. I feel like we could have had like better draft picks. But hey, <laughs> get what we get. 